Hi, I'm Robert Ratliff and welcome to a Recover Cast. And today I have with us Mr. Greg Dawson with the Small Business Administration. Greg, um, under these circumstances, I guess still welcome to Tuscaloosa. We're glad to have you here. Uh, would you please share with us and for all of our internet viewers exactly what SBA does and what opportunities are available for people, for people that have been affected by this recent storm. Thank you, and let me say uh, from uh, on behalf of the agency, uh, our prayers are with the people of Alabama who have been impacted uh, by this horrific uh, incident. Uh, I am a public affairs specialist with the U.S. Small Business Administration Office of Disaster Assistance. It is my job to make sure no stones are turned in getting out information on assistance available to victims impacted by tornado. Uh, we partner with FEMA in all presidential declarations. Uh, we have been doing this since 1946 and what we want to know, people to know is the first thing you need to do if you were impacted is register with FEMA. Once you register with FEMA, all times you're going to receive an SBA application in the mail. Most times people will get that application because of the nature of our name, Small Business Administration. Homeowners will say, well, I'm not a small business. Why are they sending this to me? They'll take that and toss it in the trash. That's the first mistake. If you receive that application, it is absolutely critical that you complete it or all federal assistance will cease at that point. Case being, Everybody's not going to qualify for an SBA loan. For those individuals who don't qualify, SBA is going to refer them back to FEMA for their other needs assistance program, and that's where the grant dollars are. Now, what is available to homeowners as well as businesses, homeowners can borrow up to $200,000. Uh, renters can borrow up to $40,000, and this includes the loss of uh, clothing, uh, appliances, as well as automobiles. Businesses can borrow up to two million dollars, and we've got a category that's called economic injury. And what economic injury is is the business did not sustain physical damage, but you are losing revenue as a result of this incident. You can qualify for up to two million dollars. Major industries can qualify above that ceiling, uh, such, such as a, a BF Goodrich, uh, which is a major employer employee here, uh, they could go above that $2 million ceiling in terms of assistance from the agency. But the one critical message that we want people to know and to understand is if you receive an SBA application, it is key and critical that you complete that application. We've got disaster recovery centers where we partner with FEMA to provide assistance to victims that have been impacted. If you can't get into a disaster recovery center, call our 1-800 number, which is 1-800-659-2955. One of our customer service representatives will walk you through the application process. I stress to people, you need to get into a disaster recovery center, and you can call that 1-800 number. They will tell you where the closest disaster recovery center to your location is. It is better for you to sit down one-on-one -on -one with our customer service representatives who are going to walk you through the application process. And you don't need to fear the paperwork because we're going to assist you with that. We're here to help and we want to help. That's all good information. Um, and we've got your contact information on our website, recovertuscaloosa.com. So uh, we'll make sure that we keep relaying that same information out. Anything else we need to share with these folks this morning? Well, just uh, if you've been impacted, don't disqualify yourself by not applying. That is the one thing people tend to do. Uh, the other thing is that rumors run abundantly in any disaster. I tell people, if you're not speaking with a representative who has this SBA shirt on, but more importantly, who has these SBA credentials, you're not getting it from the horse's mouth. So speak to one of our representatives so that we can assist you. That's a good point. Give them that 800 number one more time. That is 1-800-659-2955. Or you could go to www.sba.gov. That's the SBA, the Small Business Administration. They are here in Tuscaloosa, West Alabama, and in the state of Alabama, here to help you, those that have been affected by these recent storms. I'm Robert Ratliff, and we'll see you next time.